2017 is turning out to be a bit of an anus horribilis for Novak Djokovic. Ahead of the French Open he teamed with André Agassi as the Serb looked for coaching guidance from the American tennis great. But Djokovic crashed out of the French Open after he was crushed by Dominic Team 7-6-7-5-6-3-6-0 in the quarterfinals. In May 2017, Novak Djokovic parted ways with his entire coaching team in a bid to rediscover his winning spark. Scroll through the gallery to see who has been part of the Serbs coaching team over the years. Nikola Pilic 1999-2003 A French Open finalist in 1973, Nikola Nicky Pilic went on to become the first captain to win the David E. Cup trophy for three different nations. The Croatian coached a teenage Djokovic at his tennis academy in Oberschleißheim, Germany. Dejan Petrovic 2004-2005 Djokovic was coached by Dejan Petrovic from the age of 16, moving over 200 places up the rankings into the ATP Top 100 inside a year. Petrovic, an Australian-born Serb, also coached 2008 French Open winner Anna Ivanovic from 2014 to 2015, Riccardo Piatti 2005-2006 Italian tennis coach Riccardo Piatti divided his time between working with Djokovic and former world number 3 Ivan Lubasic. Despite only coaching Djokovic until the Serb was 18, Piatti claimed he always knew his protégé was destined for greatness because he battled so hard. Marion Vida 2006-2017 Former Czechoslovakia tennis player Marion Vida coached Djokovic for over a decade, guiding his charge to 12 Grand Slam titles. The two parted ways in May 2017 as Djokovic sought shock therapy and a fresh direction ahead of the French Open. Mark Woodford 2007 Alongside Vida, Djokovic worked with Australian 12-time Grand Slam doubles champion Mark Woodford during the spring hardcourt season in 2007, honing his volleys and net play. Todd Martin 2009-2010 With his first major under his belt, the 2008 Australian Open, Djokovic turned to American former world number 4 in the summer of 2009. The pairing ceased when the Serb lost his opening match of the Miami Masters after Martin had tried and failed to rejuvenate the Djokovic serve. Gebhard Filgrich 2009-2017 Djokovic hired German fitness coach Gebhard Filgrich R in the spring of 2009 having identified conditioning as a weakness in his game. The two worked together until May 2017, Igor Setayevich 2010-2011 The most transformational figure in Djokovic's illustrious career was arguably not a coach but a nutritionist. Dr. Igor Setayevich instructed the Serb to undertake a gluten-free diet, immediately alleviating his breathing problems and bringing spectacular results. Boris Becker 2013-2016 Djokovic appointed six-time Grand Slam champion Boris Becker head coach in December 2013, citing him as a true legend. It would become a fruitful partnership, with Djokovic winning six major titles in three years, the time of our life they ended their arrangement in December 2016, capping a tumultuous year for Djokovic, who released a statement saying, I will make all future decisions. Becker, in the aftermath of the announcement, posted on Twitter, Thank you. We had the time of our life. Andre Agassi 2017 When Djokovic ended his long-standing relationship with Vida in May 2017, it appeared he was ready to go alone. But ahead of his French Open title defense, the 30-year-old turned to yet another so-called supercoach, approaching Agassi later that month and citing his tremendous respect for the American. CNN 12-time Grand Slam champion Novak Djokovic has decided not to play again during the 2017 season due to a long-standing elbow injury. His decision means he will miss the first major tournament of his career next month's US Open, which starts at Flushing Meadows on August 28. The world number four, who won the US Open in 2011 and 2015, HASNT trained since his shock withdrawal from the Wimbledon quarterfinals. After a year and a half of carrying an elbow injury I've made the decision not to play any competition for the rest of 2017, Djokovic, 30, said in a video posted on his Facebook page. All the doctors I've consulted, and all the specialists I have visited, in Serbia and all over the world, have agreed that this injury requires rest, he added in a statement on his website. Reid Marejogovic's absence from the US Open ends a run of 51 consecutive appearances at Grand Slam tournaments which stretches back to his first major, the 2005 Australian Open. 
Only Feliciano Lopez 62 and Fernando Vadasco 57 are on longer streaks. It's a new experience for me, new circumstances, said Djokovic. I'm trying to look at it from a brighter side. I have time where I can dedicate myself to healing and building up my body and focusing on certain aspects and elements of my game which I never had time to work on, read, from career grand slam to crisis five-year foundation last year. Also in July 26, Roger Federer announced he was taking the rest of the year off. The break stood the Swiss star, who turns 36 in August, in very good stead with grand slam victories at the Australian Open and Wimbledon in 2017. I took time to make a decision about my recovery. Sorry for keeping you in the dark these days. Read more here https colon slash slash t dot co slash tcs w 46 all 2 Novak Djokovic at Joe Kernel July 26, 2017 Will the same formula work for the 30-year-old Djokovic? He really want to play professional tennis for many years to come, added the Serb, who in his statement spoke of building a foundation for the next five years or more, during Djokovic's period of dominance, in which he picked up 11 major titles in just five years, many said the Serb was more machine than man. But the 30-year-old has endured a considerable fall from grace since completing the career Grand Slam at last season's French Open, failing to make a major final this year for the first time since 2009, he was forced to retire due to the injury during his Wimbledon quarter in all match against Thomas Burdick and in his Facebook statement Djokovic revealed that the pain had intensified over the last couple of months, read, the making of Roger Federer birth of second child the Serbs absence from the tour will coincide with a new arrival to the Djokovic family. Djokovic, I am happy to share that Andre Agassi is committed to stay with me next year. Stuart Fraser at Stu underscore Fraser July 26, 2017 Another important moment is coming, we will become parents for a second time. My wife Yelena and I are expecting our second child, and we are preparing to welcome a new family member. These are things that fill me with greatest happiness and delight. I'm confident I will be ready for start of the new season. Visit cnn.com slash motorsport for more news and videos. Djokovic also revealed he will continue working with Andre Agassi as his head coach. We've been speaking regularly. Andre was with me in Toronto and he helped me find doctors, specialists in treating elbow injuries. During this short period of time, we've been getting to know each other and building trust and understanding. He supports my decision to take a break, and remains my head coach, he is going to help me get back into shape and bounce back strong after the recovery period.